Okay, guys. So I hope you could like the, you like the video. Subscribe. What you're going to watch is part two of a video I did with Serge. I want to say a week or two ago. I know I need to shave. I need to go to the barber. I spent like three weeks on vacation with my son swimming every day, so I'm a bit like disheveled. But what you're gonna watch is this part two to this video with, with Serge. We talked about email dropshipping and TikTok dropshipping. Like the video, subscribe. The video is about to start now. Sorry, I didn't post it before. I'll be posting a lot more videos regularly from tomorrow. Tomorrow we have a video that comes out on MC011. But anyway, I hope you like the video. Have a good one. Peace. Now quite a while and it's going nicely. I like TikTok because there's no this um, advantage on TikTok that you don't have on uh, on eBay. Um, so first you of all, an advantage you don't have on eBay. What, what, go ahead. Yes. Why do you say that? First of all, you don't have the expenses that you have on eBay. It's a little bit less. That's one. And on the second thing is that you have less competition uh, because. Well, when you um, say no expenses, you mean because you're not paying per store. First, you don't pay your store. You also don't pay the same fees like you pay on eBay. Uh, the eBay um, commission. Oh, the seller fee, the final, the final value fee. Exactly. Uh, the, the commission, after you're selling, you're paying a high commission. Uh, no, it's it's less than half on TikTok. You know? And you don't have those limits that when you have an eBay account, you are very limited how many items you can sell unless you have an unlimited account. Which is not there's not a many of those. So um, on TikTok, of course, you've got to be cautious as well. You can't just do anything on TikTok. You got to know what you're doing. You got to start slowly, uh, like any platform. But right. once you are starting to show that you are um, a responsible seller, that you ship the product on time, you add tracking numbers on time, and they like it, and then they see that you are reliable. That's what they want. They want to see reliable sellers on the platform. Right. right. Okay. 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 And what <laughs> when you say it's doing very well, what type of money are you making per account? What should someone expect when dropshipping on TikTok? Because when we dropship on eBay, like I want to make in each account at least two thousand dollars. Not too much, but ideally I'll want to make two thousand dollars profit per eBay account. What how much? Uh, is your goal when dropshipping on TikTok? I think that this is something. Uh, it's some. It's definitely something that's achievable on TikTok, uh, even more. But uh, the mm -hmm. thing is that you cannot do it right away. It does. It's a process, like on eBay. You gotta do it. Start the right way, which you cannot just suddenly list five thousand items. You gotta do it uh, the right way because. When you do anything that is out of the ordinary, or even if it is on eBay or on TikTok, then they will suspend your account because then they think that some sort of a fraud. We have to start slowly and let it grow the right way, healthy way, and that way you slowly increasing the 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 quantity of product that you are listing, and then you're going to start seeing a little bit more sales. And the nice thing with TikTok, which you don't have also with eBay, is that there's a way that you can use influencers. Okay, but obviously that's for a later stage. But right. when you are generating sales, you can then approach influencers. So it means those sellers, not sellers, the people who have a TikTok account with many, many followers, sometimes even a million followers. So when they post a video, there's a lot of people who will see that video and they can do a little promotion for the product that you are selling. And when you do right. that, then so you can have a lot of orders because then obviously you give them something from the sale as well. But they can help you generate many sales. That's something you don't have on eBay. Right, right, right. Okay, okay, okay. It's a good opportunity. Okay, and do you think, are you have, in the community that you're in, are you having more people wanting to learn how to dropship on TikTok and eBay or do they want want like the the services where like you offer this like we'll put a link to um to search company in the description because he yes. manages accounts both ebay and tiktok now i i manage a couple of accounts on ebay i don't manage like i personally run a tiktok account and i'm working with with uh some guys but i i think i mentioned before i had a very bad experience with those guys last week 
So I'm rectifying that now. But are you seeing people wanting to learn how to drop ship, or do they just want the accounts managed? I think that it is. Um... I think this is something quite new now that there is more of this option available that someone would run the account for you. Uh, there are many courses available. Uh, you see on YouTube as well. There's a lot of people yeah. who are teaching it. But the difficult thing is to how do I actually make this work for me and make profit from this? And that is the question everyone wants to know. And that's why I think when someone runs the account, when we have a team uh, of they're professional. They know what they're doing. We've been working on many accounts, so we got the experience. We know this you don't do, this you avoid, those type of product you would list, and this is experience that you gain. Something that's a little bit more difficult when you're on your own, because when you're on your own, you got to learn all this with experience, and that can take time. You don't always going to be able to see that through videos or a course that you learn. You can learn this, but it can take a little bit of a longer um, time. And if someone runs your account, you probably will see sales faster than than if you had to do a course on your own. You know, it's a little bit right. and it's right. a little bit more work to, okay. to do. Okay, okay. So, guys, so, if you're watching this video and you have any questions for myself, you have any questions for Serge, let us know. Um, in my opinion, like the eBay campaign, eBay and TikTok, I've been doing eBay a very long time. I've done Amazon. I've done Walmart. Um eBay is still around like 13 years yes. later or 15 years later, however long it was. Um, so I value the the I value the fact that I understand eBay and I know what to expect. You know what I mean? eBay is like, okay, I can make money, eBay drop shipping consistently every month, pay my bills, whatever. Um TikTok and I and I made a video, I interviewed Stone and 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 um about TikTok drop shipping. And I think TikTok dropshipping is a huge opportunity. I've seen the sales come. They seem to want to be okay with dropshippers. Um, so I think it will last for a, a while, but it's an interesting time because in 2024, you have people who are now start trying to start dropshipping and you have all these courses online that you didn't have before. And I think it's more about the consistency, and I do agree with you. With a with a good service, or or the ability to get a group, a team to to manage the accounts who have experience, it is a huge value add, and you can yeah, save absolutely. a lot of time with that. Yeah, so yeah, so the they're coming with a lot more experience, you know, which uh, can take a longer time. So basically, in order to see results faster, it will be basically with a team that would handle your account. You right, know? right, right, exactly. Okay, so is there anything else? What else would you like to tell YouTube before we go? Because I want to have you again. We could have the next call and focus maybe solely on TikTok. But what is something you'd like to share with YouTube before we go? I think that there is a very big market. You know, um, probably whoever go and listen to this uh, interview, you see a lot of people are busy with a mobile phone everywhere. Everywhere we right. go, see people uh, playing with their phones. And it means that people who are with their phone, they are, a lot of them are also placing orders on the phone. So orders would mean people would buy through eBay, through TikTok, Amazon, all those platforms. And they are, so it means that there is a massive market for people or consumer who want to buy products online. So this is definitely a place to be. Uh, the reason we do drop shipping is that there is not a, a big investment. You don't have to buy the stock. Uh, in the past, you had to open. I used to have shops, um, clothing shops, in the many years back, physical shop in a shopping center, and it was right. a, a lot of money to invest to have the products and everything. These days, you don't even need this. You can have uh, a shop on eBay or on TikTok. You don't have to own the products. Once you sell anything. You go and you place the orders on Amazon or another platform. So there's not an investment in the merchandise. That's why I feel there is. It's You can have a business that can produce money for you. And these days, you can even have someone run the business for you. So it's basically, you can be totally lazy here. Let someone right. do the work. There's, the investment, obviously, is just to have the person manage it. But it's not something which costs... Uh, like in the past where we you used to invest in the product to buy product 
and then you don't even know if you're going to sell it. Here you only right. list product, and when you sell it, that's when you buy the product at the supply. So right. The, so, and I forgot to ask you something. Are you guys using any software for either eBay or, or TikTok dropshipping? Because for eBay, for I use eBay. Sniper, and for TikTok. I use um, Fox Lister, right? But that just lists the item to the TikTok shop. But what what do you guys use? We use uh, Yabale for uh, for eBay, but um, mm. on TikTok we do things manually. I prefer to not use a, a Lister. We use uh, we list things. Why uh, is that? Uh, because look, I, and I know I might be biased about Fox Lister and FBM Fox, but they actually got like an official partnership with TikTok. So they okay. shouldn't. So they so check them out. There shouldn't be a problem using um. Okay. Using okay. Fox system. We found that uh, um, it's just a little bit safer with TikTok uh, when you do things without a list. You know. Also, for example, for eBay, we use um, um, you know non API. You know, so we right, right, yeah, like yeah. Okay, say that. Go ahead, go ahead, because I have a question about that. So doing this, it means that you really don't have a list as such, like in the old days, where you have a list connected directly on your account. So right. that's the right way to do it. This is the me, way to do it. It comes to non-API, right? But do you, when I first made the SGE, we, it was connected through the API, and then there was all of this like non-API thing, and then... Um, what do you call this other company? What's it? What's it big? The other drop shipping, not DSM. Auto DS. Uh, huh? Auto DS or Auto DS? Auto DS, right? So there was all this thing about all these accounts getting flagged because the API. Yes. I yes. have not personally experienced getting flagged because the API, but have you seen that actually happen? Yes, yes. You can see that suddenly there's a, not a lot of sales. And even when you do promoted listing on eBay, there's still not uh, a big movement uh, compared to another uh, account that you also do uh, promoted listing. And there you'll see a lot more activities, you know, more uh, people entering the account and buying and all that. So, so that in, that shows basically that that the account is flagged. But you see, if the account was with a a list that was API, you cannot certainly put it non-API because they recognize it on eBay. Right, they right. Know it so okay. so it, you're going to need to have a new account, basically. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. So guys, like the video, subscribe, ask any questions in the comment section. I will leave a link to, um, to Serge's community, to his website. And if you guys, if you guys have an eBay account and a TikTok account and it's not making money for you, it should be making money. For you. So if you would like help making money with either eBay or TikTok, just reach out to us and, and yeah, have a good one, guys. Thank you.